So people change, how many lives are living strange? Where were you while we were getting high? Slowly walking down the hall, faster than a cannonball. Where were you while we were getting high? Someday you will find me, caught beneath the landslide. In a champagne supernova in the sky Someday you will find me Caught beneath the landslide In a champagne supernova A champagne supernova in the sky up the dawn and ask her why a dream a dream she never dies wipe that tear away now from your eyes slowly walking down the hall faster than a cannonball where were you while we were getting high someday you will find me Shall I 
sky Someday you will find me Carving the last line And the champagne sipping over The champagne sipping over Cause people believe That they're gonna get away from the sun Special people change How many lives are living strange Where we, while we were getting high Slowly walking down the hall Faster than a cannonball Where we, while we were getting high So many will find me Thank 
Whatever. I went down to the beach and saw Kiki. She was all like, eh, and I'm like, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Uh, good morning, Nurse D. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> good morning, Robbie. Yeah, whatever. All right. So. My schedule's been off this week. I woke up kind of early. Uh, early enough that we can go for our jog. Uh, how's the gardening looking? Uh, I only planted the seeds last week, so no seeds yet. No seedlings yet. Today, though, hopefully it doesn't... Fuck, I should check the weather. Hold on. I think it's going to rain. Every weekend, you know, that I've had my daughter and I'm like, okay, let's go to the garden. It's fucking rain every weekend for like the past, I don't know how many weekends. Yeah, whatever. I'm gonna put your phones away. The toy octopus. I was thinking, maybe but it is packing in a punch with some wind. And again, if we have a chance of some thunderstorm. Spoony, Spoony. You're supposed to be on Team Robbie, not on Team Carl, okay? You, of all people, should know what a hypocrite Carl is. <laughs> Yesterday, I was mad at you. I always bring up Carl. He always brings me up, Spoonie. Right? Can someone keep track of how often Carl brings me up versus how I how often I bring up Carl? The hypocrisy. We have temperatures making it back up to it looks like those nice 50s, upper 50s out there for long. Uh, Beach. So yeah, it is a cool. We have temperatures making it back up to it looks like those nice 50s, upper 50s out there for Long Beach. So, yeah, it is a cool start to the morning. We're back to 66 degrees over in a Palm Springs. No, I'm just kidding, Spoonie. Um, how do you call it? Um, Matt, Mo, Mo came in, you know, yesterday while I was building my air filter. And, uh, and he reminded me, you know, <laughs> that you're a betrayer. Uh, I should be first unicorn. But no. Carl is first. Carl is your first unicorn. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. All right, then. Thank you. All right, then. All right. All right. Okay, all right. Oh, okay. You see, you feel bad. <laughs> That's your guilt. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I forgive you, Spoonies. Brings me, you'll notice that it's pretty hazy outside. We do have some cloud coverage out there and a little bit of drizzle and mist happening out towards Southern California as a possibility. Here this morning, we do have enhancing. Get my shoes. That is a possibility as we get into tonight too. But then the real.
Took this fucking internet. Chance of rain doesn't it. come in until tomorrow. It looks like early in the morning. We might get a little opportunity of some rainfall in Ventura County. But again, the front still out towards areas of San Luis Obispo, Santa Barbara. And that doesn't really climb and really trek into Ventura. To do that you trying to scare me or what <laughs> sleep car go watch pokemon or something We get into about three o'clock in the afternoon. We have some light showers beginning for Los Angeles down into areas of Orange County. That's a possibility right around three o'clock. But really, the heavier amounts of rain do not arrive till we get into about 5:30. That's for Ventura, Los Angeles. It's still pretty light in Orange County. It might not be amounting to much out there. Not till we get into the later afternoon, early evening, that Orange County Inland Empire get to see some of that rain really get going. We have some snow in the mountains, so that's Saturday. But Sunday we have another chance of rain, kind of the same pattern. There's a front that'll be moving on through, maybe some light showers before the front enters. But once it does, anywhere from the early afternoon into it looks like the later afternoon hours, Los Angeles. Angeles, inland Orange County, and the Inland Empire. We'll be dealing with some rain and even some snow in our mountains. We could expect to see, too, a chance of some thunderstorms on Sunday. So we might have some heavy amounts of rain for a short, brief period of time before it exits. So this system is a smaller system, but it is packing in a punch with some wind. And again, if we have a chance of some thunderstorms, that would be on Sunday. That'll move out really quickly, though. By Sunday evening, it's out of here. And then Monday, we should be free and clear of rain, although there's a small little 10% chance of some drizzle. We do have a ridge of high pressure building in right after that, so it's going to get warmer again. So we're we're kind of dealing with some weather whiplash around here. 74 San Bernardino Riverside. Foothills are back into the upper 60s, low 70s and 72 in Inglewood. Uh -huh. Temperatures in the Fillmore, 73 and 69 degrees in the Northridge, Los Angeles, Inland Orange County. He doesn't. 72, Saturday, right. Sunday, 63. We have some windy oh, weather. Oh, it's going to rain again. Breezy between See? Saturday and Sunday. We could pick up as much as a quarter of an inch to half an inch of rain. Then on Monday, we have some partly cloudy skies. We clear out really nicely. Tuesday on Sunday, so we might have some heavy light showers before the front enters, but it's still pretty light in Orange County, Ventura, till we get into about 3 o'clock in the afternoon. We have some light shower county, but again, the front still out towards areas of San Luis Obispo, Santa Barbara, and that doesn't really... ...of San Luis Obispo, Santa Barbara, and that doesn't... Really It, it, it sounds like fun, uh, Spoonie, but believe me, the traffic, the, the drive up there, no way. Trust me, it's not, I mean, I, I, I do want to do that, but not today. All right. Really climb and really trek into Ventura till we get into. So other than that, what's going on? I got my signs. I did my air filter. Uh, what else? Anything good on? And there's been nothing to watch. I, I mean, there's nothing to watch on YouTube anymore. Like the Scientology protesting is boring. I don't know. That's why, like I yesterday when I when I did the air filter thing, I, I was like, screw it, because I got I already had the camera, you know, the phone set up, so I was gonna jog, but but yeah. spoonies. We need more live streamers. Or I don't know about more live streamers. We something entertaining to watch. I'm 
watch. Nothing to watch. Nothing to watch. All right, I'm going to put on my shoes. You're about to watch some jogging. Let's watch the pretty girls. Hopefully they're girls. I don't blame you, Spoonies. Thank you, Spoonies. You too. Uh, oh, you streamed last night. Or is it or this is just a video? Huh? Hey there. I hope you're having a great night on your side of the world. It's a beautiful day over here in Japan. Spoonie's narration. Hey there. I need, I need you to hook me up with some of these uh, Asian leftover women. <laughs> or whatever they call them. <laughs> the leftovers. <laughs> I'll take it. Curl around one more time for y'all. What's that thing over? It's called that. China. <laughs> I need to go to China. <laughs> I need to go to China. There you go. That's all I got for you guys. Have a great weekend. Good to see you, Amanda. Catch you guys later. Okay, Spoonies, so in Japan, are there leftover women like there are in China? You know, is it a thing where like, you know, they, they just want to have a baby? You know, can I just go over there and put a bunch of babies and then leave? <laughs> thing? Uh. <laughs> have you ever been called a leftover woman? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. No matter how excellent you are, how capable you are, in the larger society's mind, you're not as good as a man. My name is Wei Ting Ting. I'm one of the feminists who get arrested before the International Women's Day. We're in China, where women are experiencing unprecedented financial freedom. And since Mao founded the People's Republic of China in 1949, have enjoyed equal rights to men, well, at least on paper. Up until the communist revolution, women were pretty much considered property, 
and their feet were tied. Then Mao, when breaking the norms of social class and gender, declared that women carry half the sky, and gender equality was written into the constitution. I would always admit that I'm a beneficiary of the socialist women's liberation. Remember how American women were empowered to join the workforce in the 1940s when the men left for war, and then sent back to the kitchen in the 50s when they returned? Back in the days of... All right, well, who we'll called that plan B? Who we'll called that plan B? <laughs> Uh, okay, so then, so then there are no leftover women in Japan. What is the ratio of, of men to women? Hold on. Uh, I need to go. <laughs> I'm just kidding, God. Uh, but seriously, <laughs> but seriously. Uh, let's see. The male Japan has, which is the fourth highest in the world. The sex ratio is ninety-four. Armenia. I got to go to Armenia, Ukraine. All right. All right. I, I'm going there. <laughs> uh, good morning. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. We're not doing anything. Oh. <laughs> uh, we're just messing around. <laughs> yeah, don't just don't. Anyways, um, <coughs> my desk is a mess. Let me set up the stream to jog. It's Saturday. I don't have to take my kid to school, so I got some time we're gonna jog for 20 minutes maybe i'll push it up to to 25 because because shells is running 30 30 minutes a day over here so yeah no. <laughs> <laughs> it's a trap it's a trap <sighs> So we're up to 479 subscribers. So going vertical in the garden, that's what I'm going to call my stream. I'm going to call it going vertical in the garden has been has been working. Uh, you know, 10 subs maybe per day, something like that, maybe. Eh, right? Somewhere around there. Just saying, Spoonie, all right? You're telling me that they don't want to be moms? They want to be moms. They want to be moms. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Whatever, Spoonie. Don't judge me. You see why I don't tell you guys nothing? Because you guys judge me over here. <sighs> There you judge me.
Everyone seems to like the puppets, Spoonies, so you need to do more of that. Are you talking to me or are you talking to, uh, to Spoonies? Because if so, I know. <laughs> I know. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. Uh. Anyways, <laughs> go there. All right. Um, so, yeah, I don't got anything. Uh, there's nothing to watch. Uh, I watched that X Men, the new X Men cartoon episode where. Or spoilers, spoilers if you haven't seen it, where Gambit dies, you know, which was traumatizing. And they just had like, you know, this disaster and all the all the mutants died. <sighs> Anyways, I always liked uh, the X-Men because of the... I guess the, what is it, the allegory? No. Um, the allegory, is that the word that I'm looking for? You know, uh, it, how it's compared to racism, basically. <laughs> no, I'm not. All right. Whatever. You'll see. Yeah, like uh, uh it's in the pop culture now. It's a thing now. You know? So mm -hmm. What I'm trying to say is like How do I say this? Like It, it, it's a it's a reflection of of how of who we are in a way, you know, like compared from like nine like like what the idea is is it's a cartoon from 1997, you know that only only you know millennials or you know Gen Z or whatever you know grew up watching it, and and now looking back at it, it's like a mirror of ourselves, you know, and all the things that happened since then, you know? I I don't know. I, I'm getting too deep on it, but yeah. That, 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 <laughs> the, the, do you know what I'm saying? Does anybody know what I'm talking about? Like, it's a cartoon that was canceled in the 90s and they brought it back for people like me who watched it and looking at it now or watching it now and thinking about all the shit that's happened from then to now you know like the 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 mutants just had 9-11 over here <laughs> the mutants just had their 9-11 spoonie <laughs> uh, uh. Anyways, all right. <laughs> Building seven did not did not collapse because of a fire, people. Okay. Oh, exactly. <laughs> uh. 
<clears throat> it's like the Matrix, Spoonie. You got to watch it. You got to see it for yourself, okay? But that's what I'm trying to say. That that that's why I think it's interesting because, you know, looking at it from that's why you probably don't get it because you didn't watch it when you were a kid. So then watching it now as an adult, you know, like it's 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 weird. <clears throat> All right. So have a great day. Stay out of trouble. Be productive. All that. <laughs> All right, we're definitely getting X Men puppets. Yep, yep. Actually, you know what? I probably have some action figures in my in my daughter's closet right now. Oh, X Men Legos, genius, man! Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna put it on the on the wish list. Hold on, I'm putting it on the wish list. X Men Legos. Hold on, hold on. Legos. Awesome. Eighty four dollars. Oh, I'm not spending eighty four dollars on this. Now I got the stupid song. It's stuck in my head, too. <laughs> no, it doesn't. All right. Oh shit. Look how badass that is. <laughs> What? No way. <laughs> All right. So uh, I'm going to put it on my wish list. How do I do that again? I forgot. How do I, how do, I do that? Oh, I know. I know. No. Is that... How do I do that? Oh yeah, okay. Hold on, I haven't I haven't looked at my list in a while. Let's see what I got on here. Oh, uh, I don't want no more Lego trains. We got plenty of Lego trains. Lego trains. Set. Okay, I'm deleting all these Lego trains. Uh, the Hocus Pocus house. That would be nice. This giant castle, that would be nice. All right, so the only thing I got on my wish list is the X-Men thing and some and some mics. All right. <laughs> that, that would be worth making out of Legos. Uh, a, a little Brett. Hold on, hold on. There's got to be a little. It's a, it's a, it's got to be like a Chevy truck, right? Chevy Lego truck. Like this one, maybe only orange. That kind of looks like it, right? That one. Or this one. Oh, look at this one. That's got to be fake.
This one, like that little green one. <clears throat> All right. Someone remind me. Good night, Spoonie. All right. I'm going to go take a, a break. Uh, go over to the stream over here. Here, I'll just post it again. Dogs. We're doing 20 minutes or 25 minutes. We'll do 25. All right. Have a great day. Stay out of trouble. Be productive. All that jazz.